वो तो एक नहीं है दो तो है एक जो यहाँ खड़ा है और दूसरे आप हर एक आप The day she came into the world the sun forgot to set and when she left the world there was a night when darkness was not even called to leave The journey between June 21 1953 and December 27 2007 is a continuous struggle of half a decade After completing her studies in Britain Benazir Bhutto returned home in 1977 Soon after the government of her father Zulfikar Ali Bhutto was overthrown by Zaulox military martial law Mr Bhutto ki hukumat khatam ho chuki hai Sare mulk mein martial law nafiz kar diya gaya hai Qaumi aur subai assemblyan tod di gayi hain And Zulfikar Ali Bhutto was hanged by a verdict that will forever be ashamed of judicial history Benazir Bhutto was forced to go into exile in 1984 after being imprisoned during the martial law period but she could not be pulled back from the struggle to restore democracy When Benazir returned home in 1986 the storm of people in the true sense came to welcome her in Lahore And once again the power was given to people's party with the strength and love of the nation मैं बेनजीर भुट्टो सिद्ध के दिल से हल्फ उठाती हूँ मैं खलूस नीयत से पाकिस्तान की हामी और वफादार रहूंगी बिहाइंड द सीन्स कॉन्स्परसीज कंटिन्यूड एंड वंस अगेन शी वॉज रिमूव फ्रॉम पावर लेस देन टू ईयर्स लेटर बट द पीपल डिड नॉट अलाउ देर लीडर टू स्टे अवे फ्रॉम पावर फॉर लॉन्ग एंड इन नाइनटीन नाइनटी थ्री शी वंस अगेन वन द इलेक्शन एंड केम बैक टू द गवर्नमेंट But once again she was not able to complete her 5 years term when the government was taken away from her again. And in 1998 she once again had to go into self-imposed exile. While living in the United Kingdom the great and brave Benazir Bhutto faced the dictatorship of Pervez Musharraf and forgot the bitterness with her long-time political rival Nawaz Sharif. Despite the dangers, decided to return home in October 2007. Two suicide attacks on reception rally in Karachi and the deaths of many friends and bodyguards did not scare them and they did not distance themselves from the people. At the same time, the darkest day of December 27 arrived in Rawalpindi's historic Liaquat Bagh addressing a historic meeting. Benazir Bhutto came out from the roof of the car to show her love and to thank the people for their love and was targeted by the terrorist in the crowd she was seriously injured and was brought to the central hospital at the present benazir bhutto hospital at a distance of a few kilometers but the doctors gave the sad news that she was martyred this news came as a shock to every democratic pakistani Before this fire engulfed the entire country, Asif Ali Zardari, the husband of the deceased, poured water on the burning flames by giving a message to his youth about Pakistan. Terrorists and these handlers tried to remove Benazir Bhutto from the people forever, but her place could not be taken away from the hearts of the people. Dad's Ladley Pinky is still alive in the hearts of people as Shaheed Rani but the sad part is that even after the decade and a half her killers are still unknown